I say what old chaps and chap, it's Game Chap and Birdie here. Yes! Yes indeed, fellows, and I would say to you now that we have here some rather interesting Minecraft news for you pertaining to future updates. Go to me, what do we have, old boy? Well, yes indeed we do, chap. You see, Mr. John Kegstorm, someone said to him for ages now, animals have tried to jump over the fence. And you're sort of bouncing up and down like they do. Up and down, up and down. Bouncy, 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 yes, quite old chap, yes. Well, yes indeed, and he said, are you going to fix it? And Mr. John Kegstorm said yes, eventually, but then went on to say that more with the new AI will not try to jump over fences from the next update thing they do. No, splendid I say, jolly good show there. So yes indeed the current light of animals whereby they will continually bind the banner doorway trying to get over fences will now yes. be jolly wiped and stamped out once and for all I say. Yes, you'll just stand there just staring at you, blink, blink like that. Uh, going moo, moo, moo and ba, ba, ba. Well, and that was such right, yes, yes. And you see, then Mr. Don Cadron went on to say that zombies will be more forgetful in the next release they do. Plus they won't be able to blindly track you died. Ah, indeed, so perhaps unnerving of sorts to zombie intelligence there, so they won't be able to suddenly say, oh, there's a human, I'm going to track him for the next 55 years until I very well get him, I say. Well, yes, indeed, you're standing three miles away, then turning around and saying, ah, oh, there you are, and running after you. Precisely, No, right. they'll have to see you, you see, ah. because they, no, the zombies are stupid, they, they shouldn't do this anyway. They're supposed to be bad, you stupid well, alcohol. Good show, yeah. Yes, now, what about Mr. Jeb, I say? Well, yes, indeed, Mr. Jeb has said a few things. He was asked, will pathfinding be made for other mobs, you see, and he went on to say, yes, Mr. Mr. John Kegstrom is working and updating all the mobs one by one. Ah. But he said skeletons will try to avoid the sunlight. Oh, the crafty blighters. Go yes, his indeed. Skeletons indeed, their fellows, will try to go for the shade to avoid burning to a crisp in the side scenes. Yes, indeed. You see, they're going to be... Well, maybe they're getting the intelligence of the zombies, you see. No, by George. They're going to sit under these trees now, just be, some, you're bathing and sitting there and firing the bloody arrows at you. Oh, goodness sakes, Andrew Kent. Well, what, what's next? Screamers, I say. Well, yes. No, no. It's worse than that. Do you know what's happened? What? Well, Mr. Jeb also went on to say that slimes may spawn in jungles because someone said to him, what if slimes spawn in jungles? Oh. And he said, well, yes, that idea had crossed my mind. Oh, so in jungles is going to be ooh, ooh, ah, ah, slop, 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 I say. Well, it, th there may well be, you see. Oh. Someone said to him, well, why, what do you want the slimes in jungles for, you see? And he said, well, because jungles are wet and slimy. Well, of course, I say. I mean, why not? Be so yes. you might well have a, an entire legion of slimes popping around, not only on the flatlands, but also in the ballet jungle, I say. Well, yes, of course, you see. So you just be going along your way and the sun Big slime will bounce up and say, Here I am! Oh, yes, indeed, we're swimming in a sea of paddy slimes, I think. Good bit. Well, there you are, chaps and chabbits. I dare say no more paddy animals trying to jump over fences, yes. less in terms of zombies, yes. skeletons trying to avoid the sun, and slimes in the jungle, you know. Yes, imagine them. They'll just turn your knees to jelly when you see them. Oh, thank you, old boy. Good bit. There you are, chaps and chabbits. Yes. I would say to you, this hasn't even been a game, chap and buddy, news update, bulletin of sorts. Thank yes. you most kindly for joining us. So we look forward to seeing you once more in the next exciting idea, I say. Yes, Until then.